Now I know many of you love your fishing, but I'm still learning the basics and could do with some help. I've never really spent enough time fishing to develop a strong interest or passion for it, but maybe this is about to change. Anything biting there, buddy? Recently, the kids have been asking about going fishing. So when I spotted these two rods at the local shops, I figured it was a sign from above. This was a complete impulse purchase, but the rods seemed a good size for the kids, and I was hoping I could also take them out on the jet ski. Now sometimes, these spontaneous decisions turn out to be the best, but I'm still a little unsure if I've purchased the right type of reel. You see, most jet ski fishermen seem to be using spinner reels, but these reels I've purchased are quite different, and I've never seen them being used on a jet ski before. Well, at least not that I've noticed. These reels are made by an Australian company called Alvi, who have been manufacturing fishing reels right here in Australia for the past 100 years. Alvi reels come in all different sizes, with a range of models made from a variety of materials, including graphite, fiberglass, aluminium, stainless steel, and even wood. These reels are highly regarded here in Australia, and are practically collector items that are passed down through generations. Alvi reels are quite unique in their design, and are termed side cast reels. When casting, the reel is turned 90 degrees to the rod. In this position, the line freely flows off the spool, allowing a longer cast. Alvi reels are also a very simple design, with relatively few moving parts, which makes them incredibly durable. Even after being in salt water and sand, a simple rinse off in fresh water is all the maintenance they require. Unfortunately, making such a long lasting product isn't great for business, and Alvi almost closed back in 2017. Thankfully, a groundswell of support saved the iconic Australian company, and they are now selling internationally, including in the US. Alvi's exceptional durability, combined with their long distance casting, means they're most often used for beach fishing. When matched with a long surf rod, they're ideal for casting over the breaking waves from the shoreline. Now, my Alvi rig is much more compact than the normal beach setup. It's called the Adventurer Combo and comprises a four inch diameter reel on a fiberglass rod that is only five foot long. It's made primarily for kids, but I'm hoping it's also suitable for taking on the jet ski. And we've got our Alvi reel here. Okay, so tell me, have I made a poor decision or will this Alvi reel and rod work well for jet ski fishing? Let me know in the comments below if you have any experience or recommendations on the best setup for jet ski fishing. Well, now I just have to rig them up and go catch something. Well, thanks for watching. Hang in there and I'll see you next time.